hi friends i'm back with one more video so this is going to be like very very interesting video so i've been just trying to do some sort of research on the butterfly if you look at my youtube video so i have the iron fly series you you can see the triangle series straddle series debit spread ratio spread usd inr uh, i've been doing some research on the butterfly then i got to know i think butterfly strategies right i mean it's it's one of the piece of mind traits i'll just take you to that but this video is a sort of teaser on butterfly so i'll just make a very short video uh covering some important points on the butterfly so watch till the end friends watch till the end and if you feel like it makes sense so then let's start the series on butterfly by just making like three to four videos or three to five videos so wherein we'll be covering with real time simulations okay so i need all the concern from you guys i need all the uh, what do we say the sort of uh, the consent from you saying that yes is absolutely makes sense so then i'll i'll make the uh, detailed video so this is a sort of uh, teaser okay the way we see the movies right i'm just giving a small snapshot uh, snapshot of the butterfly uh, this is my ppt see when i say i mean it butterfly are the piece of mind trade which basically has the low risk and it is like dead easy for all of us to manage <coughs> i'll show you butterfly uh when you compare the butterfly and iron iron fly right i'll just try to show you the pop the rest to reward in the margin i'm not going to show you the standard way like what is butterfly what is uh, iron fly right i'll just try to show you some unique things so wherein this will this will be like a eye opener video for you so i'm i'm not sure like whether you will be finding this type this type of content anywhere on the youtube yes you might be finding but i'm not sure you will be not able to find uh, this content easily on the youtube maybe there could be few because even i've followed my guru right so even i learn from them and then uh, i'm just customizing i'll just put my thought process and then i came up with the uh, ppt right <coughs> so what i mean to say is like we will just see the butterfly iron fly pop rest reward margin uh, the third bullet as it says iron fly see we all are familiar with the iron fly iron fly we basically go for the iron fly for the for the non directional right everyone knows the fact that iron fly is meant only for non directional we can make it directional also in terms of cutting down the wing on the call side or cutting down the wing on the put side but i'll show you the disadvantages whenever we want to go for iron fly as a directional uh, so we have to go into the in the money and then we will end up into all those slippages issue i'll show you stay with me i'll show you butterfly is the best for the directional trades okay uh, so what i'll try to do is rather than me telling every all the theoretical right see i mean just um, this is a uh, teaser right uh, so i'll show you all the adjustments on right away i'll show you like 1 2 3 4 5 6 adjustments on a real trade i'm not just trying to simulate i've deployed a butterfly for you all guys and i'm going to show you the live adjustments uh, in this sensible okay let me take you to uh, let me take you to the sensible okay so friends if you look at my screen so this is my original butterfly <coughs> right if you want to know what is butterfly if someone doesn't know what is butterfly so i would recommend them to watch my video i've already made a video on butterfly that was a very basic level video so you need the basic understanding about the butterfly but stay with me i think if you are able to understand you can just get it from this video also so i have deployed the butterfly for 28 july not for the 21st because we have hardly only two days for the 20th for the 28 july i have deployed the butterfly at 35500 ce i sold two lots and then uh, 500 uh, below and 500 above that is a pure butterfly i have just deployed it on the call side because i am bullish about the market okay i was bullish about the market so i have deployed uh, this butterfly <coughs> okay now my overall loss is 6000 sorry 659 you know right today market almost at the end of the day it gave a big spike bank nifty it gave a big spike so my loss is 659 if you check the uh, if you check the maximum loss i have the maximum loss of 3.4% and friends this is one of the good enhancements like which sensible has given now we can see the percentage right what is the maximum percentage and what is the maximum uh, what do we say loss initially it was uh, missing in the sensible so now this is a very good because in, every time i used to do that calculation in the calculator but i think some sort of manual effort has been reduced okay so this is my butterfly for the uh, 28 july two sold and plus 500 and minus 500 i bought it as an edge so my my maximum profit is 10256 15% my maximum loss is 2224 now if i show you the iron fly 
okay so there is no difference between butterfly and iron fly so this is see just to save the time i've already deployed i've taken the same sole position 35000 pe 35500 sorry 35500 pe and ce check my butterfly same 35000 ce i've taken two quantities but you know right iron fly is all about combo basically you i took the 35000 this is basically a straddle and as a edge i took this edge so now okay let me tell you friend let me tell you i think <coughs> i'm not sure whether you're aware of this thing right if i start doing this so then this will not become a teaser right i wanted to make this video teaser okay let me show you see butterfly is a combination of is a combination of credit spreads and a debit spread if you're not aware of this thing so let me prove you see if you look at this 35500s right i i bought 35500 and i sold 35500 so what is it that's a debit spread right i have two quantities and then i sold 35500 ce one more additional and then i bought 36000 so this is typical your credit spreads if you're not able to get it okay let me let me uh, uncheck this one i'll go to edit do i have that option okay so i think i have to go to <coughs> in that case i think i have to go to uh one second friend i have to go to my uh virtual trade because in the virtual trade i can do that edit part okay give me a second i'll go to my virtual trade <coughs> i think i've saved that uh 28 yeah 28 butterfly let me click on this thing L click on analyze okay the same butterfly friend see the same butterfly only for the demonstration i'll be using so what did i say the butterfly is a combination of one debit spread and one credit spreads if if you want to see that uh, what i'll do i'll just unselect this okay and then i'll go to edit we have two quantity right we have two quantity i'll go to edit what i'll do i'll just make it one quantity so now everything will be cleared for you done so what is this basically 35500 bought and 35500 sold so this is your typical what debit spread okay this is typical your debit spread and i'll uncheck this i'll select this <coughs> so this is your typical credit spreads you got my point so butterfly is a combination of one debit spread and one credit spread this is what you need to know if you get this right adjustments will be very easy for you okay see if i select even this by leg so this is your butterfly but again what i have to do i have to just increase it to quantity two because for the demonstration purpose i have made it quantity one see if i have these two quantities this is your butterfly but what is iron fly now right i have made so many videos iron fly is a combination of what one right what is this i'll show you this is your credit spread <coughs> put credit spread see these two boxes are checked if i deselect this thing if i select this thing this is your call credit spread that's it i'll not spend more time because i've made many videos on the iron fly is a combination of what two credit spreads but your iron fly sorry your butterfly is a combination of two sorry one credit spread and one debit spread when i say i mean it because that's where your adjustments will come into picture if you do not know the difference of what is credit spread what is debit spreads guys you have to watch my series go back to my youtube video watch all those videos if you're directly watching all what is credit spreads you will be not able to understand and then you'll quit the market nothing is rocket science but the only thing is the you need to learn everything in sequence okay let me take you to <coughs> uh, sensible and okay so we discussed about see peace of mind trade stay with me friends stay with me and let you know right if i start showing everything this will not become a teaser because i've started with saying that teaser on butterfly i think already i'm done with like 10 or 15 minutes this is not at all a teaser so i think this is becoming as good as a full-time movie okay so what did i see uh, see all these things will discuss friends all these things will discuss but i'll just focus on this adjustments i know you all are aware of doing this adjustments okay so now what i'll do directly i'll take you to the uh what my uh butterfly i'll try to show you all the adjustments and then if you get some time we'll again come back to the ppt this slide and we'll see now what did i say the first adjustment is <coughs> close the debit spread and manage the credit spread independently <coughs> friends state st I mean, just keep attention right maybe maybe a few things might be like bouncing but nothing is rocket sense very simple so this is my 
butterfly this is my real butterfly friends this is my real but if you want i can show you the legs also the uh, that's what i don't want to show the legs but at least i mean people will not believe see 35000 35500 and 36000 see 35 you yeah, see 35 35 5 see uh, this, this there are only five legs basically that's it i don't have see even i can scroll you, you have to just pause the video and check the premiums and everything right this is my real trade so let's say so friends let's say uh bank nifty stands at your break even <coughs> let's say even i can do the do the uh, show you adjustments but just to make it more realistic let's say your bank nifty starts at your break even so then you have only 2224 loss that is 3% on the overall capital deployed but you have the potential of 15% so this will give you less panic but still if you want right if you still if you want to uh, mitigate the loss what you have to do is like see what did i say it's basically a combination of debit spread and credit spread if you look at this profit stay with me friends if you look at this profit this is a debit spread right right this your buy position is in profit and one of the leg one of the leg what i meant to say is like one of the leg is your uh, your sole position for this debit spread so what i'm what i'm uh, see the adjustment what i want to do is like i'll do so i will exit the debit spread i'll exit the debit spread i'll just retain the credit spread okay i'll show you uh, let me delete okay so what i'll do i'll just uh, book this 35000 ce i'll go here i'll book 35 what is that i'm bad at my numbers 35000 i'm just booking 35000 right sold okay and then what is my sold position sold position is like 35500 but i have two quantities right so i'll exit one quantity so 35500 i've sold it so i'll just buy them what is 35500 35500 i'll buy back okay sorry see because we are doing the blunder mistake because we are doing it for the 21st july we have to go for 28 july so 35000 i'll sell it and what was it 35500 i'll buy it are we doing the right thing let me this is what i do friends okay 35000 ce and 35500 okay <coughs> 35000 i'll sell this for 28 and then what is the other leg i have 35500 i have to buy back 35500 i have to buy back that's it friends see this is your credit spread so what we have done we have just booked our debit spread right because this is giving you profit see 5824 and then we have exited one of the legs so the the remaining leg is your credit spread now people will ask right we have already booked the profit <coughs> now this is your typical credit spread if someone has a concern of market might go down right for them i'll show you one adjustment if someone has the uh, a uh, concern uh, not that concern if someone says that market has to go down sorry market has to go up i have the solution for people who have the uh, view of market going up so then they will end up into this loss i have also have the solution for people who think that market is going uh, going to go down i have the solution for them also okay so now what i have to do is like we are doing the adjustments at the wrong time because we i'm just trying to because what did i say okay stay with me friends stay with me i'm just making now what you can do is like this is your credit spread this is your typical debit spread sorry this is your credit spread call credit spread so you have one sold position and you have one bought position so what you have to do is like what is the loss here 6300 let me go to calculator 6300 divided by 25 is the bank nifty lot size 252 so either you can go for 252 you can just collect the uh, 252 credit to make this loss zero or else you can just divide it to three so 84 rupees is the premium what i have to collect okay i'll go to add <coughs> right wherever i have the 84 rupees right see this let's say this one right i'll sell 184 rupees that's it friend right because i have to cover 252 what i've done i've just divided 252 divided by three so 84 if you are okay if you are okay with this loss if you feel like okay today's uh what today's uh uh we, we have another see 28 july right so we have another like seven to eight days for the expiry i'll be not very aggressive i'll be able to cover this loss as and when i go close to expiry you can just go for selling 88 the moment you do this check your loss friend your loss was six thousand year the moment you bought this your loss has become only 4089 and check your profit your profit has increased five percent is your 
capital see initially it was six percent so now your profit will be definitely you'll be like uh, profit will be because you'll be able to increase the profit now if someone is not comfortable saying that market will go down it will end somewhere here or it will end somewhere here you have to just increase the lot to two that's it see from 6000 your loss has come down to 1866 if someone is like very aggressive no market will come down will fall down go for three lots see that's the reason i keep on telling adjustments are very dynamic so i cannot see i'm just telling i'm just giving all the adjustments for all the audience aggressive traders conservative traders right view based traders so this is this is done okay so what we have done <coughs> we were able to mitigate we were able to mitigate the loss see what we have done we were able to do the we were able to close the debit spread and we are a, we are managing the we, we are managing the credit spread independently and it could be the vice versa also whenever you go for put butterfly you have to do the same right either you close the debit spread and you can just manage independently the the debit spread or the vice versa see this is only a teaser but i we will have all those detail sessions second thing shifting of selex is a second thing what i'll do I'll I'll remove all this trade. This is a second adjustment, right? What did I say? Shifting of sell leg. So what is a sold leg here? So let's say the market stands here. Your loss is two thousand two twenty four. Simple friends. What you have to do is like this is a second adjustment. Friend, I'm telling you, go here, book thirty five thousand five hundred. Simple, thirty five thousand five hundred. You have to buy back because you have to. That is those two, and then again, oh, then shift it to let's say. Uh, let's say you're selling thirty-five thousand six hundred. Let's see what will happen. Right? See, <coughs> the moment you do this, friends, check. See the magic. The moment you do this, you are able to make your call almost zero. Your call side loss almost zero. So when are we? See again, you have the safety of almost like one point four three percent. See, I'm just giving you a template. Again, do not ask me. Can I do this on Monday? Can I do this on Friday? See, and so I'm just giving you the skeleton. You have to apply your own thought process, right? Adjustments are very dynamic. I cannot say that you 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 should be able to do. You you have to do this on Monday or Friday or Thursday. Close to see. I'm just giving you the thought process. If you want, I'll make all the simulation video also with one adjustment. Friend, see, I'll deselect this with one adjustments. You are able to mitigate your loss two thousand two twenty four. Your profit was ten thousand. Right? See. Check the profit and the loss. Your loss has become almost zero on the call side. Your there is no reduction in the profit, but definitely you have some loss on your PE because this is market. If you want, if you want heads and tails, you cannot get it. You have to right adjust by doing the uh, appropriate adjust. If if you are very concerned, right? If you if you have the view of the market going up, so you have to just play around this thing. That's it. With one roll up. See, your call side profit has become almost like one thousand seven seventy four. If you are like pretty much no, I want some safety on the put side also, right? Call side also. This is only one one of the template what I am showing to you, friend, right? If you want to get this, if you want to decrease this profit, what you can do, right? You have to roll up the put, right? I have discussed this many times. You have to roll up your call side. What is this? This one. Thirty what thirty five thousand right thirty five thousand you have to roll up <coughs> okay we have discussed about this thing this is all teaser and shifting of the converting to strangle this is very interesting friend this is going to be like very interesting I'll clear this let's say <coughs> what did I say butterfly is a combination of one debit spread and one credit spread let's say the market stands here let's say the market stands here so what you can do is like you can convert it to strangle meaning. Uh, I should how should I tell you convert it to strangle. So what you have to do is like let me let me give it a try. Friend. Even I got confused. So if you want to convert it to strangle, what you have to do is like you have to exit both this legs. Pay attention, right? Pay attention, right? You have to exit thirty five thousand. You have to exit this cell and thirty five thousand five hundred, right? You have to exit this. Okay. Uh, did we select the right side? Thirty sorry thirty six thousand. My bad. Thirty six thousand. You have to exit. This two legs. What was it? Thirty-five thousand and thirty-six thousand. Two by legs. You have to exit. The moment you exit this, so let's say, let's say, the the premium of this call stands at five fifty-four. So we all know we have seen this in the debit spread. How to convert it to strangle in case if your view goes down. So what I'll do, I'll directly go to. Ah, see what is the premium? Five fifty-four. I'll directly sell. Put worth of five fifty four. Simple. I'll sell this, right? More or less five fifty four, right? This will show you this payoff. So I have to go for two lots. That's it. 
so now you were you are able to convert your butterfly to strangle and now you have to do your strangle management it's up to you it's up to you basically you go for same premium or you go for like uh, go for strikes it's it's completely up to you so this is your this is your strangle all right so what did we discuss we have discussed about this adjustment shifting of uh, cell legs within one with one adjustment so you are able to mitigate your loss and we discussed about how to uh, convert to strangle and in case if you do not have the what do we say if you do not have uh, the what we say uh, sorry uh, one second if you do not have the margin right what you have to do you exit this one lot right you exit this one lot and just go for one lot here that's it you have the provision you exit this one lot and convert it to strangle with the one lot that's it or else you can if you have the margin you can go for two lots and then you have to manage this as a independent strangle so if you want to know the adjustments i have the video on this triangle series where i have shown you how to do how to manage this triangle by delta or else by the premium okay so what is the other adjustment <coughs> converting to debit split right uh, see uh, yeah already we have discussed that right? we 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 were able to convert to debit split and then we were able to convert the debit split to ratio split and also uh, we have also discussed that close the ds and manage the uh, credit split independently this this two are like and the other thing is like simple roll up or roll down right again i'll deselect everything this is your uh what do we say your uh, butterfly so let's see what will happen so what i'll do <coughs> i'll just exit 35000 okay what what there is a 35000 i'll book and what will happen if i go for uh this thing if i roll up the put uh, buy actually okay so now uh see i mean basically if you do this actually ideally we should have rolled down okay even i will show this if you roll up you will be able to mitigate your loss as good as a strangle if you will be able to mitigate your loss uh, see let's let me show you if i deselect this thing your loss was 2224 if you are rolling up the call your loss has reduced to 939 but definitely the extra debit what we have given that will add up your call or else what you can do clear this trade what is the other thing 36000 go to here book the 36000 meaning uh, uh, book it and then roll down by 100 that's it see if you don't roll down by 100 points your loss on the call side will be mitigated and friends i am showing you on the live day i mean i mean what i mean to say do after the market hours this is my live trade so all this adjustments i'll be doing it right if you want you can just go one more point that's it see this has become your 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 call side has become lossless if someone wants the market will come down just go one or team that's it your loss 2000 has become almost like 1161 so what did we discussed we have discussed about this thing also what is it roll up roll down the box see within like 10 20 minutes we have discussed about 1 2 3 4 5 and additional butterfly see what <laughs> what i meant to say is additional butterfly let's say this is your butterfly right let's say this. i can deploy one more butterfly also here so where does the market stands right i'll go to addition add trade 28 july so where is my 35900 so let's see 35900 where is 35900 let let me go for like uh, this thing let me see if if i have some overlapping legs give me a second i'll go for two and then i'll go for like five one Two, three. Let's let's four, five, buy, and then let me see what happens. Right. So there is a overlapping frenzy. Basically, see even even this works. Even if you go for one more butterfly, right? Check the range. See if I deselect this thing, your butterfly was having a cone shape. Right. This was your loss area. Right. This this vertical line is your loss area. So what we have done, we have deployed one more butterfly. Right. The moment we do this, keep a check on the range and everything. Right. Now. the loss area will give you profit your though your profit is reduced but you will get a good range not like the cone shape check check this this was a cone shape and you have almost like how much from 35000 to almost like 35000 uh, 36000 so you have 400 points of the range right you your range is increased though your profit has decreased but your loss is also increased i'll just leave leave it to you or else let me try to do let me try to do this way okay uh okay so i think friends i think uh, we will just cover this uh uh in the upcoming videos but what i 
a need from you guys is like if you feel like this makes sense this is only a teaser so i'll be making like one each video like 30 minutes 40 minutes video we'll discuss about all these things how how the butterfly what is a pop uh, risk to reward uh, see I'll, I'll 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 close the session with one more thing so when i say i said this thing butterfly best for directional trades and your iron fly will it, it's it's very it's it's a difficult to go for directional i'll just prove this okay let me take you to okay i'll do one thing again friends and there is one more thing let's say uh, difference between uh what is that one give me a second difference between the debit spread and the butterfly what is the difference between debit spread and butterfly so this is your butterfly let me raise it right even this is a directional trade and even your debit spread is the directional trade where is the debit spread yeah even your debit spread is also a directional trade the only difference is in the debit spread you have limited profit but even if the market makes a upper circuit of 5% 10% you'll get your uh, maximum profit but in the butterfly let's say i've deployed the butterfly when the market was standing here literally friend my 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 view was bullish but you know right i've deployed the butterfly when the market was standing here but you know right today bank nifty gave a wild moment that's the reason my butterfly is here standing but still i have only 659 loss because i have only 2000 loss friends i can easily do the adjustments I, that i'll not even get into panic situation even if i have a down circuit of 10 percent my maximum loss would be like 224 i'll do my best in terms of making it zero or making it 500 loss or if market gives market gives me an opportunity i'll come up with the profit let's see i have like another eight or nine days because 28th is the expiry day okay so now <coughs> let me prove you like why butterfly can be a very good uh, trade for the direction okay i'll go <coughs> let's see i'll go here i'll go for the strategy so let's say you are bullish about the market okay you are bullish about the market i'll take 28 april so market stands at 35720 right 35700 so let's say you are bullish about the market so what do we do in the iron fly we go for uh at the money so let's say you are bullish about the market so what i'll do rather than deploying the butterfly 35700 i'll go like 300 strikes because you are bullish i'll sell this two quantity right maybe i'll come somewhere here like 500 points like one two three four five i'll buy this and then one two three four five so usually this is the butterfly right that's it now now check the beauty right you are bullish about the market so rather than keeping the market in the between you are keeping somewhere here so that you will get more safety on the upside 1.86 if i want to do the same thing in the iron fly can i do that okay let me let me show you i want to do this do the same thing in the uh, iron fly I, I i'm bullish about the iron fly let me show you i'll go to 28 <coughs> so what we can do right if i want to do the same thing and iron fly the market stands at 34 35720 so i think i have to go like one two three hundred points inside that means in the money so don't you think we will be having this slippages issue so okay let me show you right sell sell what will you do you will buy 34500 34500 and then 36300 36300 right see even even see i think you have to go in the money basically so i'll do one thing i'm doing it right way your market is standing here so what what is that i'm selling like actually 35 400 right still this is going am i doing it right way or not okay let me uh delete clear of this thing 28 april <coughs> sorry 28 july your market stands at 35 okay so what i have to do if you are bullish about the market uh you have to go let's see right okay am i doing something wrong okay mm. okay friends i'll do one thing i mean i just uh lost somewhere uh so i let's let's talk about this thing uh in the upcoming videos in case if you feel like or else this this is extending actually because i've started like a trailer but uh, as a teaser but this is as good as a movie so i'll do one thing okay let me take you to the ppt i'll do one thing i'll just uh stop the video here so if you feel like right if you feel like uh, i wanted to do like a couple of videos on the butterfly the entire series it might be like three videos four videos five videos please let me know friends so based on that i'll just 
uh, come up with those five to six videos okay but what i need is like i need more comments on this video even if i get like decent comments like 20 to 30 comments i'll be making this video and also please share with your friends i need more likes please give give it i mean just for the effort give it a thumbs up friends give it a like right i'm just putting so much of effort you know right it is very difficult see now just now i am completely lost uh, for showing you the butterfly is is good for directional but uh, the iron fly we cannot do because we end up into all the slippage issue i'm completely lost but what i'll do right rather than extending the hours i'll just go back and i'll do some research and then again i'll make a video but the only thing is like i need more likes i need comments from you guys i need uh consent from you saying that yes go ahead and do the uh what do we say the uh, series on the butterfly and believe me friends this is not the end of adjustments right and in case when i say peace of mind trade this will be like peace of mind trades you will even forget deploying the iron fly right if i make that five to six videos of the series right right i mean you will not even get into panic situation the way we go for iron fly we have like bigger loss we have to adjust this you, you saw right the adjustments are so easy right only I've, I've just within like 10 20 minutes i've told you like five to six adjustments and i've just put the reason i have another magical adjustments but i need consent from you all guys i need likes and comments okay thank you friends thank you for thank you for watching my video